I'll never be more loved than I am right now. Wasn't holding you up, so there's nothing I could do to let you down. It doesn't take a trophy to make you proud. I'll never be more loved than I am right now. Going through a storm, but I won't go down. I hear your voice. So I wouldn't drown. You've never been closer than you are right now. Oh, Jira, you are enough. Jira, you are enough. I can see so clear what it's all about. Stay by my side when the sun goes down. Don't wanna forget how I feel right now. Oh, child, you are enough.
as I put. I put my faith in Jesus, my anchor to the ground, my hope and firm foundation to never let me. Come on, church, where you're at, declare that. I put my faith in Jesus, my anchor to the ground, my hope and firm foundation. He'll never let me One thing I desire, only this I see, just to dwell. This will be my posture, laying at your feet, just to dwell.
not just your presence but the power of your presence that we can be here and come in one way and because of your love and your grace and your mercy and your presence that we leave change that everything that's attached to us changes that our lives change our families change our homes change our jobs change that our perspective changes right here in your presence our shame is removed our guilt is removed Our hearts are mended in your presence. Your presence changes everything. If you know his presence is a life-changing thing, would you lift up words of worship and words of praise for his presence, for his presence, for his presence, for his presence. In his presence, there is fullness of joy and pleasures forevermore. In his presence is liberty. In his presence is his spirit. In his presence, there's healing. In his presence, there's joy. In his presence, there's salvation. We thank you for your presence. I'll never be the same with joy. That's what it says. Oh, yeah. All things are possible when we believe, and old chains are breakable when we receive Yahweh. You keep your promises. If you said it, hey, we believe it, yeah. If you said it, sing it out. If you said it, we believe it. Hey. Yeah. If you said it, we believe it. Cause you're a man. Say, you're a man of your word. If you said it, we believe it. Yeah. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. If you said it, we believe it. Cause you're a man. Say, Cause you're a man. Believe it. Believe it. If you said it, 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 if you said it,
we have this confidence that you'll finish what you started and God you have never failed you won't start with me you're pressing in every step, oh, in every step. you're patient in every heart oh, yeah. and God you have never failed and you, you won't start, start. If you said it, we believe it. Yeah, oh, yeah. sing it, y'all. Hey. Oh, 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 oh. And if you said it, we believe it. Oh, yeah. Sure, man.
speak so every day you have declared us right every day let us hold every day yes. and I am what I am hallelujah cause the great I am Into your family. Yeah. Last time, sing it with us. Say, I am what I am. Cause the great I am. Every day, every moment, speaks he speaks over me. Yeah. He's speaking now, he's speaking now. He's speaking now, he's speaking now. Singing songs of healing, singing songs of freedom, singing songs of breakthrough. We believe your word, we believe your word We trust your word, we trust your word yeah. Your truth over opinions, we believe your word Yeah, yeah what I am, I am what I am Cause the great I am Right now, speaks so may have had a lot of words declared over you, but I am what I am. His word above all. The great I am. Yeah. Speaks over me. What you say is true. What you say is true. Said I am what I am. Cause the great I am. Speaks over One more time we'll sing I am what I am Cause the great I am Speaks over me Yes he knows, yes he knows Yeah. 
Of your goodness, oh, who you'll be forever. Remind us of your nature, oh. I remember when I was young, and your voice shouting loud my name. Since that moment, haven't heard it quite that way. Oh God, now that I'm older, could you say it again? Oh, I remember I was afraid. And know the hand I felt lead the way. And for the first time in my life, I felt safe Oh God, now that I'm older Could you lead me again? Oh, when the storm's out On the ocean And the violent wind Gets to blow And oh, take me back Back All the way back Oh, take me back to my first love and I remember when I was blind and then your love it opened up my eyes and all the light that flooded my life well God now that I'm older would you show me again God would you show me Take me back 
I've known it from the start And there's no space between It's good news The heavens in my heart No
deal. Is anybody happy to be in the house of the Lord on Resurrection Day? Because I'm not sure. I'm not sure how many of us are happy to be in the house. Because we're singing about my story. And if it's your story too, if you've been raised to life by the one who conquered the grave, then I think you're going to have to feel a little bit, little bit more energy in your bones this morning. Because it was resurrection breath that came into your lungs. The same resurrection breath that came into Jesus' lungs that caused him to come up out of the tomb. That's what we carry this morning. Does anybody believe that? Is anybody with us? Because I think we need to feel it. I mean, some of you got the clap. That's good. Let's keep it clapping. If you're more comfortable with the clap. But then some of us might need to feel a little bit in our shoulders or something. I think we need some training. Who we got that can give a little training? AJ, you want to show us a little something? Here, give us a little something. That's what I'm talking about. So we got to be a little more free in the house. And you may be saying, this is crazy. Let me tell you, it is crazy because it's resurrection life. And what we're about to do is we're going to prophesy over some dry bones today. Just like it says in Ezekiel, the prophet, God told the prophet, speak over these dry bones and cause them to live. It is the power of God that breathes life into dry bones. And Jesus, when he was at the tomb of Lazarus, remember the story. He said, Lazarus, come out. And what happened? Lazarus came out of the tomb and he came out with his grave clothes on. And when they unwrapped him, he was alive. He was free. And that's our story. So we're going to prophesy over some dry bones and we're going to tell them to get up today. We're going to tell them to get up out of the grave. And we're going to believe that in the power of Jesus' name, we will come alive. We will come alive. Come on, we sing. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that Get up, get up, get
song when everything is fine. It's easy to sing this song when things are going your way. It's easy to sing this song when the war is on another side of the, the, the globe. But when it hits your home, when it hits your own home, sometimes it's hard to sing these words. Sometimes it's hard to remember the track record of a faithful and perfect and amazing and wonderful God. And it's not him, it's us. We so quickly forget who he is. We so quickly forget how he moves. And if you can, I, don't, I just heard this. As soon as we started singing the song, I just heard that we were supposed to almost sing it to each other. To encourage our neighbors, to encourage our brothers and our sisters, to encourage our mothers and our daughters, our fathers and our sons, our nephews, our cousins, everybody, our friends. Encourage them about the faithfulness of our God because sometimes it's hard to remember on your own and you need somebody to encourage you. And how many know that we've been called to encourage one another even with songs and hymns and spiritual songs? And so it's an opportunity for us to encourage one another in the Lord. Is that okay? Yeah. 
turn it in your favor and watch him work it for your good cause he's not done with what he started he's not done until it's good so let him turn it let him turn it in your favor Watch him work it for your good Cause he's not done with what he started No, no He's not done until it's good So hello peace Hello joy, hello love, hello strength, hello hope, it's a new horizon, hello peace, hello joy, hello love, hello strength, hello hope, it's a new horizon, if you're
This is not yours to hold. Goodbye, fear. Goodbye, guilt. Goodbye, you weren't meant for shame. You weren't meant for shame. Goodbye, pain. Goodbye, it's a new horizon. Let it go, let it go. Let it go, let it go. You weren't meant for shame. You weren't meant for shame. It's not yours to hold. Cause he bought it, he purchased it, you're free indeed, cause who the sun sets free is free indeed, free indeed, cause who the sun sets free is free indeed, it's free indeed, so let the light in, let the light on in. It's a new horizon, let the light in, let the light on in. It's a new horizon, let the light in, let the light on in. It's a new horizon, let the light in, let the light on in.
see, it's easy to sing this song when everything is fine. It's easy to sing this song when things are going your way. It's easy to sing this song when the war is on another side of the, the, the globe. But when it hits your home, when it hits your own home, sometimes it's hard to sing these words. Sometimes it's hard to remember the track record of a faithful and perfect and amazing and wonderful God. And it's not him, it's us. We so quickly forget who he is. We so quickly forget how he moves. And if you can, I, don't, I just heard this. As soon as we started singing the song, I just heard that we were supposed to almost sing it to each other. To encourage our neighbors, to encourage our brothers and our sisters, to encourage our mothers and our daughters, our fathers and our sons, our nephews, our cousins, everybody, our friends. Encourage them about the faithfulness of our God because sometimes it's hard to remember on your own and you need somebody to encourage you. And how many know that we've been called to encourage one another even with songs and hymns and spiritual songs? And so it's an opportunity for us to encourage one another in the Lord. Is that okay?
feels like faith is running out I've come too far to turn around I know God will work it out God will work it out One thing I know